Hello my beautiful bastard Uncle Butcher in the building with my first Lexington setup. This name of the assault rifle is a unit pure animal. I wish Messi would introduce this weapon to the game way way sooner because we are sick and tired from ongoing meta for multiple years now and this weapon would be welcome addition and fresh breath of air because this bad boy not only has crazy DPS output but also accuracy handling for new players this weapon will be absolutely gorgeous and even for me this weapon will be the way to go moving forward in PvP and PV, but uh, I will take my time with this one, just like with UX. <laughs> because I don't have right now any proficiency levels on this bad boy, you can potentially get crazy DPS out of this one with those proficiency ranks on. And to make this weapon even more delicious, I paired it up with True Patriot set. Welcome to the Insanity! True Patriot set is also one of my favorite sets in the game. Maybe it's not the strongest, but definitely one of the coolest ones in the game with all those explosions and debuffs. Mmm, mmm, mmm. I really, really love this setup and how it works. True Patriot by itself needs some help, just like clutch talent and other things in the game. And I'm using Rigway's exotic chess piece, which will apply bleed effect on any enemy I will shoot. And that means that I have Sadist on my Lexington. Sadist is amplified weapon damage buff. I know Optimus received buff, we could use Killer, but Sadist will give us a little bit more DPS because it will be amplified weapon damage. And bleed will be not a problem, so True Patriot will give us some armor regen, Rigway's pride, Chess piece will give us armor back and bloodsucker talent as well. But before we continue, quick form day sponsor Deving.net. If you don't have enough time or good teammates, but you still want to have all the best items in your game, then Deving.net is set for you. They have absolutely amazing team on consoles. They will complete the order super quick. If you will use your promo code RBDIV or RBD, you will receive 15% discount on absolutely all service. Amazing deal, especially when right now they have some crazy sales going on. So definitely check these guys out and if you have any questions don't hesitate drop your comment down below in comment section or contact the operator but now let's get back to this Lexington setup and there is a lot to cover here so buckle up first of all I'm not using striker set that's way too boring yeah technically you can use striker set and have fun but that would be your typical build I decided to go another road here I just caused one simple thought that Rigway Spray chess piece is somehow forgotten. Previously, actually, it was really strong. You could use it in PvP as well, but now with season two, it's kind of forgotten. Collecting dust in your stash, and I decided to change it, man. Rigway Spray chess piece is not that bad, especially paired up with True Patriot. Why? Because Request Spray Chess Piece will give you not only bleed effect, which is handy, also armor regen, just like your True Patriot set with all the debuffs. Not only that, but True Patriot set will reduce incoming damage and you will receive amplified damage. <sighs> Unfortunately, I have to admit that previously True Patriot set was way stronger. At one time it was even met in PvP with Pestilence, it was broken. True Patriot worked with uh, Plage uh, Ticks and gave us ridiculous survivability and after that it received nerf and truly never recovered. Typical massive fashion, all the things that are receiving nerfs usually are not coming back for quite some time and that's the story with Rigway Sprite chess piece and other things in the game but still I really love True Patriot set because those explosions are extremely dope you have multiple debuffs you are reducing incoming damage you are amplifying your damage and you have survivability so overall you have all things you want in one set so for 
Specialization, I would recommend you to use Gunner Specialization because on kill you would receive increased rate of fire which is always nice and of course armor back on kill again for survivability purposes really good and for PV definitely Gunner Specialization is really really nice. For the guns though I am using Lexington Assault Rifle and finally I got it. Previously my stash was full and uh, after this week's uh, I guess reset or server maintenance I got uh, my first Lexington in stash and I was really happy because uh, last week everyone was just yapping how good this assault rifle is yatta 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 and I was like sitting on the sideline and just hating everyone because I didn't have this bad boy but now I have it and I'm pleasantly surprised that actually it's really decent. It will be one of the best assault rifles in the game right now. Lexington, FAMAS, Kingbreaker, well Lexington right now is the way to go. I hope it will not receive a nerf, you never know, so there's a reason why I'm really just holding myself back with all the optimization, points, materials, so I'm not investing anything in this bad boy yet, I'm simply going with the flow, playing around with it and eventually I will level it up, but right now I will not invest any points, so Mm, in it I will level it, level it up when once it will be proficient I will get some expertise levels on this bad boy but I will not be in a hurry so I just want to wait and see what what will be ha what or what will happen with this weapon sorry I'm struggling with my words goddamn for second weapon I'm using chameleon exotic assault rifle again one of the best uh, PVE PVE guns in the game right now pistol orbit these exclusive pistol for the gear I'm using four pieces from true patriot mask, holster, knee pads, gloves, chest piece is my little dirty seeker here, rig vest pride chest piece which is kind of forgotten with all the gear we got in the game right now and I decided to change this uh, situation, rig vest pride chest piece will apply bleed effect on uh, nearby enemies I think in 15 meter radius so close to mid range and that's the reason why I'm using Sadist on my Lexington. Sadist is amplified weapon damage buff, really cool. And after a couple kills, you will apply with Sadist bleed even at uh, further distances. For backpack, I'm using Cheshka backpack because we need crit chance. Unfortunately, I have headshot damage here. I would rather have additional crit chance here. To push my build to 45-46% crit chance and also my knee pads are not perfect I have armor regen there I wish I could find true Patriot knee pads with crit damage or crit chance so I could push my setup to 50 plus crit chance or to boost my crit damage because chameleon has crit chance uh, attribute so chameleon will be just fine but Lexington needs some love in terms of crit chance and that's the reason why I'm using Cheshka. Butcher drops the mic, stay safe, love you all, and Bloodsucker will make us pretty much immortal, guys. These are my modifiers, nothing crazy. See you in the next one.